Isabella on May 23rd um, was diagnosed with pineoblastoma brain cancer. It affects less than 1% of all brain cancers in children. When we were talking about her doing radiation treatment. We were referred to the Proton Center here with Scripps Proton in Northern San Diego. One day when she was kind of feeling down, we decided to come to SeaWorld. I went up to them. I asked them a question. I actually, I didn't hear them at first when they told me, when they said how many whales were in the show. How many whales are there here? And he's like, there's 11. Do you want to meet them? And well, I got to come face to face with them. Super cool. I love, I love the whales. And before, I, I didn't know much about them, but now I know a lot more. And it's just amazing gotten so close with Isabella just because I, I randomly met her and we get to meet so many people and talk with them about the whales and share the whales with them which is one of the best parts about my job is how many people I get to encounter and get to meet and get to know and Isabella's story and Isabella herself is just it's such a personal connection that I have with her my own brother is fighting his own fight with cancer and when I was a kid my mom had a brain tumor too and and so just meeting this child who's just so full of light she's a an incredible kid. We're rooting for you, but we're we're also in support of everybody. She's made a lifelong friend in me. I'll be her big sis forever. I love you, little sis. <laughs>